The First Lady and Minister of Education and Sports, Janet Museveni, has advised schools to provide holistic education that equips young people with values and skills. She noted that in pursuit of excellent academic performance, most school leaders have betrayed the very values they are expected to impart in the young people. She cited cases of head teachers who have been involved in examination malpractice and some who have sexually abused the children they are supposed to protect. You, the school head teachers and leaders, the people who children look to daily, must embody the values we want young people to inherit. You must be the actual embodiment of those values. She urged the teachers to be available and willing to play their role in the National Sexuality Education Framework that was launched by the Ministry of Education and Sports to address some of these issues. The Archbishop of the Church of Uganda, the Most Reverend Stanley Tagali, reminded the head teachers that they are representative of the church and should promote church values and good morals in Ugandan children. You are members of the Archbishop's team and you are our representatives in our schools. You have to maintain the ethos of the church to continue promoting education and complementing the government of Uganda. According to the Director of Education in the Church of Uganda province, Reverend Paul Kakoza, the church owns about 40% of all education institutions in the country, including over 2,000 pre-primary centers, 5,500 primary schools, 629 secondary schools, several tertiary institutions, and PTCs, and five universities. Remija Simbonye, UBC News.